Hello and welcome to Akshu's Kitchen. Today you will see how to prepare chicken drumstick pepper fry for which you will need the following ingredients. 7 or 8 chicken drumsticks. Today I am using exclusively the drumstick. If you want you can use the normal chicken pieces as well. Or you can also use the boneless chicken pieces cut into medium sized cubes. Any chicken pieces of your choice. 2 large sized onions or 3 medium sized onions. 1 tablespoon of ginger and garlic paste. Half a teaspoon of salt. Quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder and quarter a teaspoon of chili powder some fresh curry leaves and about 3 fourth teaspoon of black pepper powder first I am going to cook the chicken in a pressure cooker I have taken the cleaned chicken in the pressure pan along with the salt chili powder turmeric powder and 3 fourth tablespoon of the ginger and garlic paste and I am reserving the quarter tablespoon for later use add about half a cup to 3 fourth cups of water and mix it well together and I am going to close it with the lid and pressure cook for 2 whistles in medium flame and keep the cooked chicken ready do not overcook the chicken because we are going to saute it again with the onions if you overcook it it may get disintegrated so we will discard the soup or the water and we will use only the chicken pieces so that's the reason I have added very little amount of water you can also use this chicken broth for any other soup or curry or biryani if you are preparing something else that's a good flavorful soup you can use it for some other recipe but for this recipe we will not need the soup or the broth we will need only the chicken pieces drain it aside and keep it ready next in a pan I am going to add about 2 tablespoons of oil and when it is hot I am going to add the fresh curry leaves and and when it splatters well, I am going to add the two large onions or the three medium sized onions which I have roughly sliced and I am going to saute it completely for about four to five minutes until it shrinks well in size and gets a soft texture and also obtains good golden brown color like this so it took me around about four to five minutes so now at this stage I'm going to add the remaining quarter tablespoon of ginger and garlic paste you can add the whole one tablespoon of ginger and garlic paste along with the chicken but just the onions also have to get the flavor of the ginger and garlic that's the reason I am adding quarter tablespoon to it so saute it for another half a minute so that it loses the raw flavor and then add about half a teaspoon of salt and fry it well because there is no salt in the onions we have added little bit of salt only for the chicken so saute it well and then add the cooked chicken pieces and also I am going to add more curry leaves because the curry leaves are the only flavorful thing in this recipe so I am adding more curry leaves and also the black pepper powder at this stage I am using about 3 fourth to 1 teaspoon of black pepper powder you can add more or reduce it according to the spice required because that is the only spicing agent in this recipe so mix it all well thoroughly and spicy chicken drumstick pepper fry is ready you can add more onions and you can prepare it like a buji and serve with bread or you can also serve this with curd rice or rasam rice sprinkle some coriander leaves and it is excellent to serve try it and you will really like it thank you for watching akshu's kitchen